the white thorn rose. Wow, 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 wow. We are on par for a very nice hatch here. For Weed Maps TV, I am Gil, and today I'm here on location in Orange County, California at Weed Maps HQ, and I'm here to smoke some weed with you. Today I'm actually going to be taking a dab, which is very exciting for me, and I've got this hash that is some beautiful live rosin, and it's called White Thorn Rose, and it comes from a company called Bear Labs. So Bear Labs is a multiple award winning California cannabis company, and BEAR actually stands for Botanical Extraction and Research. So that's where they get the name BEAR Labs. White Thorn Rose is a cross of Paradise Punch and Lemon OG. This White Thorn Rose was grown by a company called Huckleberry Hill Farms. We actually sent a crew over to Huckleberry Hill Farms to check out the White Thorn Rose, and it was really pretty, so I'm really looking forward to a chance to crack open this box and give this a smell and give it a dab. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up this box and see on top of the box we've got a logo. On the back it says White Thorn Rose, Live rosin has a number one, which I'm pretty sure is talking about the tier of this hash. But here we go. Open that up. Put that off there. Get rid of that. There we go. Push down and spin it. That'll open it right up. Ooh, there it is. White Thorn Rose. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Wow, wow, wow. I really like the smell of this. This is a very fruity smell. It is so sweet smelling so fruity, but it has this little bit of a weird funk on the back end of it. It's just like all fruit up front. The only thing you smell when you start to inhale is like, oh my gosh, this is gonna be fruit punch. And then all of a sudden at the end, it gets all weird and fuely. <laughs> but it's it's really subtle. Yeah, I wonder what the, the flavor is gonna be like. The color is kind of like caramel, like a really light colored caramel color looking like a pretty buttery type of hash. Like I should be able to grab a dab of this really nice and easy. Um, I'm interested to know if it tastes the way it smells because if it does, I'm guessing I'm really gonna enjoy the taste of this. And then obviously I'm interested to know how it makes me feel as well. But you know, with this hash, it's really important how it looks and how it smells and the consistency of the dab and then obviously the way it makes you feel. All, all these things are what makes it really nice hash. And if any one of those things is lacking, it's, it's just less nice, right? So, um, so far we are on par for very nice hash here. Like I said, I'm pretty sure it's gonna dab really well and it smells fantastic. So super, super stoked to get into this one. So today for the showcase, I am going to use this RBR from Bear Mountain Studios. This is the Evan Mann design, and Bear Mountain Studios makes really nice glass. Evan Mann always pushing the boundaries of what you can do with the glass and dabs and all that stuff. I've got a DCS banger up here, and it's actually branded, says Weed Maps there in the bottom. I'm gonna be using this DC Cobra coil from Disorderly Conduction. I'm just gonna put this piece of quartz in there. And the way this works is this coil is heated up to 550 degrees. You can see the readout on the front. And I'm just gonna leave it there for about a minute, sitting in that, that coil. And that is gonna heat up that quartz perfectly to around 550 degrees. 
which when I take it out of there and put it back in here, it will be the perfect temperature to dab because it will be dropping in temperature the entire time. The second it leaves that coil, it's gonna start dropping in temperature. It happens pretty fast. So I'm gonna grab this mothership carb cap. We'll grab a nice dab of this white thorn rose. Stand it right there. And now this nail should be right about the right temperature to go ahead and take this dab. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab that, put it into the joint, lock it in there. White thorn rose, bare labs. Cheers to you out there. Very nice. Wow. Okay, that flavor just kind of like exploded. The flavor is very different than the smell. The smell is super fruit stripe gum slash tropical punch Kool-Aid. And the taste definitely had a lot more of a citrusy and kind of pushing towards the orange side of citrusy. Now that this white thorn rose has had some time to settle in, it is hitting me pretty good. It's hitting me pretty strong. This is definitely some nice hash. White thorn rose, it's got me talking. Bear Labs, thanks for sending over this really, really nice hash for me to take a dab of. I am always looking forward to smoking some weed or taking some dabs with you guys out there and I look forward to doing it again soon. Till then, for Weed Maps TV, I'm Gil. Peace. Click here for more episodes of the Strange Showcase.